come any closer, or I swear to God, I'll jump. I've been thinking of a way to end this nightmare. Go ahead. Do it for me. What's the matter? You scared? Maybe it'd help if I gave you a push. Truth is, Frankie, you don't have it in you. Oh, I think you'd be surprised. Oh, it's your job to help people, remember? Save lives. It's your wife who's so gifted at taking them away. She's a cold-blooded killer. Maybe she's not the only one. Hey, I would not do that if I were you. No? Why not? Because if something happens to me, the tapes from the night of Henry's murder get dumped in DCPD's lap. <laughs> you send me over this edge and you send Randy straight to prison. But she won't be alone. She'll have your father to keep her company. Shut up. All I want to do is live my life, but for some messed up reason, you can't let me do that. Why? I already told you. Yeah, but you ask for something different every day. First sex, then pills. Now you want me to sell organs on the black market? What do you want? It's simple, Frankie. My 10 million. If this were about cash, you would have left town weeks ago. Instead, you choose to stay and torture me and my wife. Oh, your wife deserves to be tortured for what she put me through. Don't you mean what Henry put you through? It's your husband who hurt you, Madison. And that's exactly why she killed him. First, you crack your husband's skull. Then you try to crack Frankie's skull. Well, you just reach for the heaviest object you could find and bam, just kill him. That's quite a theory. A little more than a theory. You couldn't stand not knowing what young Henry was up to, so you followed his cheap ass to DC, did you? <sighs> For me, maybe not so much for you. I I'm innocent until proven guilty. And you and I both know that proof is something you don't have. Because I didn't do it. Hmm. You didn't do it. There is no way in hell you're going to pin a murder on my wife. We'll see. Am I free to go now? Go is the key word in that phrase. You keep going. You get your little stuff together, you get the hell out of town, and you leave my family alone. You just can't let her walk away. She's got the tapes. These tapes are useless. Obviously, they implicate you. Place you at the scene of the crime, blow your alibi apart, so what's it gonna be, precious? Prison or a one-way ticket out of here? I want you to take Mrs. North to her room at the casino, where I'm gonna want you to get your little stuff together. Then I'm gonna want you to take and put her on a bus. Oh, a bus? A bus. And I want you to keep your eyes on her until she's on that bus, and that bus is out of sight. Come on, you. This is completely unreal. After all that stress, all that guilt, it could have been Madison who killed Henry, not me. It was Madison. No, we don't know that for sure. Maybe... Well, I tell you what we do know for sure. That that woman is out of our lives for good. You're supposed to be on a bus. I hate buses. I wouldn't go anywhere if I were you. What the hell is that? Insurance. What if she tells Frankie? He already thinks that something is up with me. No. You know what? I should, I, I should just confess to him Frankie, no. and tell him everything that's no. going on before he no. finds out on his no. own. Your wife's mouth to my ears. 
You bugged Randy. Remember that little gift I sent? Oh, I guess we gotta wait and see uh, if the other half shows up. Maybe that'll tell us who it's from. It's not very baby friendly, is it? Last time. What do you want?